Hello, everybody, and welcome back to CGDQ Redone. I'm your host, Listar, and uh, finishing off our Genesis block today, we've had a good run. Uh, now it's time to end it with Vector Man 2 with Winslinator. Hello, friend. What's going on, man? Nothing much. Uh, what's going on with you? No, not much. Just chilling. Practicing this today quite a bit. Cool. Uh, <laughs> go ahead and take it away. What, what can you tell us about this game? All right, well... If you saw Vector Man, this is pretty much the same thing. It's just uh, like the same exact physics and, and stuff that you saw in the previous run, just new levels, shooting insects instead of robots this time. And uh, difficulty we're going to be playing is cool. That's the same difficulty that was played at uh, CG Q10 or 2010, whatever year it was, sorry. <laughs> and uh, I'm okay to start. Yep, you're all good. Count yeah, me down. All right, let's do this. All right, three, two, one, go. All right, first level is real exciting. You're falling down to the planet because your ship got destroyed by a missile. And uh, that's about it. There's a bunch of bugs flying around here. But uh, if there is a uh, good time already, um, 40 second stage here. But uh, once we land on the ground, it's going to be the same platforming that you guys saw on the previous Vector Man run. All right, and here we are. So apologies if the screen is really dark. The game is actually this dark. I don't know, designers. Um, but uh, my monitor brightness is all the way up to max, just so I can see, like, anything. <laughs> Alright, so this stage is pretty much done. Um, Go for this stage pretty much is about 410. I uh, had a little bit of a mess up there at the end. That's okay. Um, most casual players, uh, this is where they got lost the most. This is a big tree climbing stage where it's like, where's the end at? It just keeps going up and up and up and it never ends. But uh, I know the right way through. It's going to be really fast. Um, I picked up an extra uh, max health power up back there and one right here. So now I got six HP instead of four. That'll help us out a lot later. Oh, nice shot by the boss. Okay. That was a five jet boosts. So same rules for the jet boosts apply this game as well. Cronin was saying that a uh, power up really deals a hell of a lot of damage to enemies. And same applies here. This is my favorite. Um, Level in the game to speedrun. It's just so smooth. Um, right there, I uh, did a. Um, I don't. I can't even remember what you call it right now. A stun boost. I, I faced myself backwards in the lava and went forward. Ah, whoa! I <laughs> just went through that platform. <laughs> Oh, man. I really hate when that happens. All right, I got one HP left. Let's see if I don't die. Really, I should take an intentional death here in a marathon, but uh, let's see what happens if we don't. Oh. Just got him. All right. All right, so I do have one HP. Let's not take it too risky here. I don't want to be too risky with those uh, acid drops there. Okay, we got a health. Good RNG. And uh, w while I'm jumping in these skating levels, you might notice that uh, I'm shooting uh, forward. And uh, that actually helps me go faster, even though that clearly violates the conservation of momentum or whatever. Here we got a couple digging stages. Just shoot a whole bunch of blocks of garbage out of your way 
to progress through the level. Still gotta be careful here because I'm only on one health. Yeah, that was okay. Nope. Not gonna risk that one. What? <laughs> Nearly died there. Okay. All right. Let's not die at the end. Plenty of close calls there. My my ruck was about to run out. I had a feeling. <laughs> Nice, almost to 347. I haven't had the best luck with health drops. Usually I'm more than one health right here. Um, oh, here we go. I had a three times multiplier and I got uh, three more health. All right, that's uh, bad. Well, um, so at the beginning of this stage, there's like a lot of sprites that are loaded. And uh, if you try to jet boost that guy at the bottom of the stage, well, your jet boost sprite will actually be canceled and you can't actually jet boost him. So I tried, because sometimes it'll work, but yeah, it's not that time. And I lost a little bit. All right, here we go, this level. Let's see what kind of RNG we get. Oh, he's walking. Good, 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 good. That guy could just block the exit there. And there's another guy over here who can be annoying. Oh. Okay. <laughs> That's two platforms I went through in the run. All right, this is... So, I got a rhinoceros power up out of that rhinoceros beetle. And man, you, you can just wreck every enemy that you run into with this awesome <laughs> and the stage is three hp for this boss okay i don't like this but i'll try oh we got this boom did it All right, coming up, we got the Shadow Nose boss already. Um, gonna be using our Jet Boost again, of course. Like we did on all the bosses so far. So useful. <laughs> Rather than just shooting. Thank you for the health drop. And I, I had a good climb up to the boss, it was decent. This is definitely the creepiest boss in the game. Quite sure how good that was. Okay. Two cycle. It's average. Alright, this level is stupid. I have to mash literally as fast as I possibly can. Let's see if I get it. Missed it. Ah! Hey. <laughs> okay. That strategy is extremely annoying. See if I could cheese the next part. Okay, here. Okay, I got it. <laughs> All right, so that's kind of hard. I'm um, getting over that wall there. The developers made it intentionally high, but not high enough to where you can't go over it. So even even though I missed the last jump, I was still able to get over that gap. <sighs> All right, well kind of poor performance for me at the tornado skip today. I was failing it a lot in practice, too. But, uh... 
No death in this stage. At least there's that that I have going for me. All right, so I lost about um, 40 seconds um, missing those uh, jumps there. Might not have seemed like I lost that much time, but that's how good making making the uh, tornado skip is. Very necessary if you want to get a world record run in this game. And uh, up here, got a two-frame jump that I'm going to try to get. I, I actually missed the first jump. Okay, not even close. <laughs> oh, and by the way, we are uh, we're a tank. So there's that. Okay. I'm gonna play it safe here. I am at one HP. Alright. Open old die. Okay. <laughs> That's how you I lost about 10 seconds in that stage there. And uh, here here you just got to you just got to mash the fire button, man. You just got you just got to kill everybody in sight. That that's like that's all you can do. Just mash, keep mashing those missiles cuz it's just an enemy onslaught. <laughs> keep doing it. <laughs> keep going. Okay, okay. Oh, I don't normally get that. Guy. And uh, this is great because I was very lucky with the uh, health drops from all the enemies here. I have uh, all eight hit points. Amazing. All right, let's see if I get this cool glitch. Nope, not yet. Okay, so we're going to get the tick punch power up. And uh, if you punch with this power up, and then jump again. Well, yeah, you can jump again. <laughs> and I just made it all the way to the top of the stage. <laughs> cool glitch, thanks to new Mr. Fox for finding that. And uh, here we are on the final boss. Oops. It's just a big spider with an exposed brain. That's pretty unsafe. And uh, we're exploiting the uh, exposed part by just jet boosting on it. That's gotta, it's gotta really hurt, man. And now that the platforms are gone, I'm just gonna shoot photons at it diagonally. All right, get ready on time. That's time. A good solid 12-12. 12-12. Cool. Yeah, that's a little bit below estimate and a tiny bit below uh, Mike's time of 16 minutes. Sweet, uh, man. A lot, lot of stuff has been discovered since then. Indeed. Great job. Yeah, yeah thanks. Thanks. Uh, world record is uh, 1053, which I got uh, three and a half years ago. I'm trying my <laughs> damnedest to beat that <laughs> lately. It's hard. <laughs> Well, hopefully soon. I mean, I oh. always got to keep optimistic about that. Yeah, I'm, I'm going to be playing this uh, at an HDQ 2020 in like a week and a half, so I want to get it before then. Hopefully I do. All right. Well, uh, thank you so much, uh, Winslet Air, for the amazing run. Do you have anything else to say about the run or uh, any shout-outs? Uh, no, I got I got nothing more, much more else to say. Um just want to give a shout out to a uh, Cronoon for uh, his good run of Vector Man, Vector Man one right before mine, and uh, shout outs to uh, Mike eighty nine or Sega Junkie as he goes by now for uh, being the pioneer of this speed run, and uh, it's one of the reasons why I picked this up. So thanks to him. Yeah, uh, thank you so much, and uh, thank you all for watching. Uh, again, quick shout out that uh, all your bits and your subs go towards helping us showcase amazing runs like this from Winslander. Uh, and if you enjoyed it, be sure to go check him out on his channel.
Uh, that is it for the Genesis block, but that's not it for CGDQ. Next up, we have the Donkey Kong block. Uh, we'll be starting with uh, Void's Donkey Kong Country run with all stages. Uh, don't go anywhere. We'll be right back. <laughs> 